Okay, in our last video we talked about how you can use the illustration of a highway and the frontage road to see if wires are in good shape. If the current's flowing the way it's supposed to along the freeway or the highway, everything's great. If the current starts to jump off, try to go someplace else, we know there's a problem with our wiring. Okay, now what I'm going to do is we're going to illustrate this for you here. I've got a power supply which is producing the power that I would get out of a normal battery. It has two leads, negative which is black, yellow which is positive. The negative is going over and I have it clipped on the frame of this lamp, so this looks just the way it would be in your car. The yellow lead coming out and going around is going to the wire that goes straight into the bulb. Hence, the bulb is lit up. Now, my voltmeter is unstable because she's got nothing to do yet. She's looking for work. Okay, I've taken the black lead from my voltmeter and I've connected it to one end of the yellow wire. I'm going to take the other lead from my voltmeter and connect it to the other end of the same wire and watch what happens. My voltmeter stabilizes. Okay, she's showing one one hundredth of one volt, almost nothing. As a rule of thumb, the usual the mark that we're watching for is one half of one volt. If less than one half of one volt shows up on the meter, the wire is okay. If more than one half of one volt tries to get through here, then we have a problem. Now, what would it look like if something were actually wrong? Well, let me see if I can show you. I'm going to disconnect my voltmeter. I'm going to disconnect the lead going to this lamp and I'm going to take and I'm going to put a ballast resistor in there, okay? This is what you would have if you were um, had a problem with the wire. The resistor would make resistance in line. I'm artificially making it now. Now with the resistance in line, watch what happens when I reconnect my voltmeter. Look at that. 2.2 volts. Remember, anything over one half of one volt indicates trouble we are four times that high. That's because something is wrong. We know what's wrong. I put a resistor in line and caused the problem, and that's what's making this lamp grow dim as opposed to being bright like she's supposed to. By simply connecting to each end of the, the leads that I'm concerned about, I've confirmed that something is wrong in here, and I will be able to go and look for it. In our next video, we'll show you how to actually start looking within a line to find the problem.